Hey guys, right now I updated my laptop the OS to the to Windows 11. Actually, this is not a finalized version of Windows 11. We just search up WinVer. Is this is the second build of Windows 11? Actually, I just installed it on my laptop. This is not a this is not a VM because I, this is part of the Insider Preview, and you can see it's OS build. Two two zero 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 point fifty one is twenty one H two. That's going to be part of Sun Valley. Actually, I mean, there's supposed to be Windows ten Sun Valley, but actually, that has been changed to be Windows eleven. So right now, this is Windows eleven home right here. And right now, if you go right, click, go right over here. You can see that the the sounds, the battery, and the in the network right now, they're already in, in one part right over here. So you, you can hover over to what your sound level is at. You can hover over to, over to your battery right here. And then you can see that what the battery percentage is right here. You can manage Wi Fi connections if available. You can click right here. You can adjust. You can adjust here. You can adjust the brightness. This is the sound you can adjust right here. Let me just test your sound of what 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 it sounds like for Windows 11. Once you hear it, now let me play this again. Once you hear this, it sounds kind of different than Windows 10. Now you can see their settings. All settings go right here. Not only can not only not only you can find it in here, you can also find it, you can also find it in here. And you, right here, this is about like pinning or removing. This is for removing the feature. Let's just click done here. Add one. You can add one. Let's just add night light. Let, let's add. Let's just unpin project. We can add more here. You can add keyboard input. You can add more. Mobile hotspot, mobile hotspot, nearby sharing or product. Pin this right here. You can unpin it by clicking here. And then click, you can click done to save this. If you turn on nightlight, see it's kind of like battery saving mode for like an iPhone. Like for an iPhone. For the settings right here, you can see that for a setting, there's, you already just put everything, everything from Windows 10 right now, there's from Windows 11, they just put it right over here on this, put it more like in a column. Like, where it's down column, like where, this is just kind of like a shortcut. Now you can you go to sys, now here's the system tab right here. You can go click on the about, like this is the laptop model right here. And then this is what I have. So like, this is a product ID. And this is a product ID, this is a device ID. Key and activation. It said it's active. Windows is active with a digital license link to your Microsoft account. Actually, there, there's going to be a. It is a free up, update, upgrade from Windows 10 to Windows 11. It's going to be free, but Windows will still be activated. If you want to upgrade to Windows 11 Pro or Enterprise, it costs money. Right now, this is a Windows 11. This is still the Windows 10 log. The, the Windows logo is still from Windows 8. And ten, but Windows Eleven had to change it to more of a Microsoft logo. It looks more of a blue Microsoft logo. Yeah, well, actually, it has to be blue. Right now, like Windows, like Windows would, like you know, Windows already used this type of logo logo for like for like almost ten years, starting from Windows Eight. Right now, they're going they're just gonna change it to like a more of a squ like four squares. Uh, you, you know if there's Bluetooth and sharing device on this is the other tab right here. You can just there's a camera right here. You can add a network camera over here from here. Like you know, they already redone re redone. Right now it's no longer a square. Right now it's kind of right now the square's a little bit. Now they just add a little curve right here. Like this, the edges are a little bit curved for the for the squares. And you can, 
And right now, for everything right here, and this is what I like about Windows 11 and for network internet. See, look, this is this is already the new, like the new icon for the new icon for the Ethernet. Properties for the The personal like this is what the def see like, this is what the what what the default wallpaper of Windows 11 looks like. You can cho choose different ones right here. They're part of Windows 11. I know Windows 11 can either use this with a light black or like with a lighter one or a darker one right over here. Here are the apps. Here are the account. Oh, this is my name is James Don. Like I'm the administrator here. And here's a gaming right here. They already have gaming mode right here. That's part of the game right here. For the, they already have the graphics right here. You can optimize your PC to for, for play, play by turning things off in the back. Crown, uh, this is there's gaming. There's a gaming tab right here. There's accessibility, so you can just there's change the text size. Here's and all those things here. Privacy and security. There's part. Of, there's Windows security right here. Windows security actually used to be Windows Defender. Right now, right now you can just open it up by clicking here. This is what Windows security looks like over here. And I'll just turn this off. Turn on virus and threat protection. You know, this still looks like Windows 10. So those things right here, this is still looks looks like looks like Windows 10 right now. They already redone this logo here. No, they already no, they already redone this redone this icon. So many things they're still the same as Windows 10. They're gonna redo Windows security soon. Windows would still do. Let's just remove it. Oh, it's in the recycle bin. This is an unwanted app from Move. That's part of protection history. Here's Windows Update. Right now, they already changed it to this look right here. Right now, they or when they redone it, they just add color to it. They or they or they don't look like the same as like Windows 10. You get a quick check for updates here. Here's like Windows Windows uh, like update history. This is Windows 10 Insider Preview. I already downloaded Windows 10 Insider Previews right here. This sort of the history set down. Downloaded. Right now, or I'm. This this was when I first bought the day before I first bought this laptop, and right now. And here, this is the Windows 11 Insider Preview. Let's see what's new. Here's part of tips. Learn about it. Learn all about it. You can learn all about it by clicking here. This is just Microsoft Edge. So you know Microsoft Edge. I remember in Microsoft Edge, there's something like where you can turn on vertical tabs, like where you can turn on vertical or make this horizontal view put right here. That's the new thing from the Microsoft Edge in Windows 11. And then you can close this off. Right now, we know Windows 11 is coming soon. So let's click on get started. This is a new this is a new logo right now. Most of the logo most of the logos and icons from Windows 11 are are, are already redone. Now this is this is part of get started. Now this is. I'm not gonna open my OneDrive. Let's go. Let's get go next. Now this is everything. Part get started. You can use your Android phone from your PC. You're all set. Now you. Another thing I'm going to show you is this widgets right here. For this widgets, you can hear that like there's a search, search the web. There's 
this right here. Export as a part of widget settings. Of course, widgets, like you can see about the weather, like this suggested for you photos and MBA. And like there's also little top stories in this widgets over here. Right now, they, they used to be right over here. Right now, Microsoft already moved it. Right now, Windows already moved this right over, over here. And another feature is that the file explorer is already redone. And so here's what the, the files are for that's going to be for Windows 11. Click on this PC. Let's see the documents right here. <laughs> the, the, the files are right oh, like this. This PC, let's go to OS. They so already just do we didn't make it look more like this for the fat like for the folder icon. This still looks like Windows like Windows 10. Like now let's go to the control panel. The search is already redone, like when you just click on here and then it will just show show you right show you here. I'll just search up control panel. In control panel, I find out most of the features are right now moved to set New to settings right now, they already redone this over. We've done all the icons here. Like hardware and sound levels already have been redone. Redone the icon. Another thing is that you can hover over here. Wait, maybe there's some, some something wrong, wrong about window. I can hover over here. I still remember, remember they have something where you hover over here and then you just click. On which side where you'll put it on to, that's to make it easier. So actually, the Microsoft maybe just remove that. So you can put it right here. You can put it down here. It's besides hovering over here and click on what you want down here. Click on what place of the of the window you want it to be. So remember so, something. If you just Volume up or volume down, volume down or volume up. So this is part right here. Still looks like when still is from Windows 8, and Microsoft still has to redo that. And so right here, those are the notifications. And the notification, and this is the calendar right here. Now let's go to now for this for this task view right now like. I'm already recording this was OBS. Like you can add a new desktop right now. They just removed the history. Like you can add a new desktop here. Let's see how much how much I'm recording right now. Right now it's 13 minutes of recording. And so I'm just gonna I'm gonna say something to y'all if Windows 11 would be better. So y'all know that Windows 95 was good. Windows me was bad. Like you know, there's a good bad, good bad pattern from from Windows and Windows 2000 plus XP was and Windows XP Windows XP was good. Windows Vista was bad. Windows 7 was good. Windows 8 and and 8.1 were bad. Windows Windows 10 was good. Windows 11, our current Windows, like we're not sure if it's gonna be. We're not sure about that. So I'll just put question mark question mark. It's just it's based on. Like we know that that it's already a good bad good bad pattern of Windows. So like, you know, Windows 11 might be. Could could be the best one, or it could be people, or could not. It could be a bad one because people really don't. People really maybe people don't really really like like those like those windows things things right on those icons here be all in all centered. Maybe that's maybe that's you can either make it center or you can just put it back here based on the. Task, go to task bar settings and 
when everything here is centered, like you know, there's a way how to make it all left. Oh, oh like there's taskbar corner overview. Center, or you can put it left right here. Same thing as this from as this, as this like when Windows 10. Put it centered. I like to. I'm already used to new stuff, so like like you know Windows 11 be making things be more centered. That's that idea was from Windows 10 X and Mac OS. Like Windows, like Windows 11, right now starts to give more more of like a glass look of Windows 7s based on. Let's open up a. There's somewhere that that's that's what's what's it's going to have, but right now. That's, I think that's kind of for like future builds of, future builds of Windows 11. Like right now there's going to be Windows 11, like if Windows 11 is bad, then we might think that Windows 12 kind, like I know like there's Windows 12 could be, there's going to be Windows 12, but it's still going to use the same as Windows 11 since Windows 8, 8.1 and 10 use the same logo. Windows 11 and 12 kind of use the same logo. Which is kind of the same as Windows 8, 8.1, and 10, Windows Vista, Windows Vista and 7, Windows 95 and 9, 98. Like right now, you know, Windows 95 I mean, and 98 were like three years apart. Windows 98 and Windows XP were three years apart. Windows, like, <laughs> Windows 98, Windows XP, Windows Vista, six years. Vista, set. Seven is three. Seven and eight is between is three years. Eight, eight point one is eight, and ten is three years. Like now, like like ten and eleven is kind of like six years. Right now, Microsoft usually releases new Windows like every usually at every three years, sometimes six years. So, like. Between like Windows XP and Vista and Windows 10 and 11, like Windows 12 could be like three years after Windows 11. Could be like, could come out like in 2024. Maybe my for Windows 13, maybe Microsoft could skip Windows Windows 13 since it's an unlucky number and move on to Windows 14. We're not we're not sure if Windows if there's going if there's going to be Windows 13 after Windows 12. It can either be Microsoft can use. Windows 13, or they can just move on to Windows 14. If like Windows 10, if no, maybe I think no one would like Windows 11 because because they don't. There's some reason I I, I don't know that on the top of my head. So I think it's, let's just leave it. We're not sure about that unless for Windows 12. Let's just think assume that it's going to be good. Like the release date for Windows 11 is going to come out like in in this fall. Right now it's currently the summer. Like if it's the fall, it's going to be called Sun. Code name is going to be called Sun Valley. Then there's going to be ver and there's going to be version updates for Windows 11, same as like Windows 10. Like Windows 10 was said to be like the last version of Windows, but actually there's a new Windows 11. Yeah. Another thing that Windows like for Windows 12, we can we can we can assume that they're still gonna be they're going to still use the same thing as Windows 11 and like you know Windows 11 maybe maybe they're just gonna, they're just gonna still work so <clears throat> so try to to rework those right here like the minimize like like to minimize here I'm like I don't know what this is it's like yeah for window. Make a full window or cl or close it. Like you know, when I was right now, if you hover over, it's just show red. Maybe we might maybe this has to be reworked. Actually, it's kind of square. Maybe that's just just put it right here. Right now, it's already like curved. So, comment down below if if I'm missing any information for Windows so for Windows Eleven. Don't forget to like subscribe like and turn on notifications and for another thing another thing before i end the video is before 
another thing before I end, end this video is that is that not, not all of y'all not most of y'all aren't subscribed make sure if you haven't subs if you're watching this video if, and if you're not subscribed please subscribe if you haven't too. and uh, I'll see you guys next time and peace out